Every time I go to the surf break, this is what's playing on the radio. Funny. I'm happy. Wish it was like a lot warmer than this. Oh yeah. <laughs> I can catch it right there. Storm did this. I don't know. Can't keep track of the nor'easters all the time. Definitely threw some rocks up though. I think those are called brant geese, something like that. Oh yeah, it was the January storm, that's right. Met the guy. He said he'd never seen the water come over this wall like that before. That January blizzard really came over the top of this. I've never seen uh, the shingles busted off there before. It's all gouged out. Water ran down here. It used to be a nice footpath. Somebody rebuilt it right there. Filled it all in right there. And then it's March 24th. That's the Atlantic Ocean. This is not the Arctic Circle. And we have ice on the rocks in the middle of a March day. Almost impossible. Because the sun's 45 degrees above the horizon. About a thousand miles that way, approaching Nova Scotia, is Bombo Genesis number one for this week. There's a storm out there deepening to 975 today. Uh, part of the front that came through and erased the 50 degree weather we had in New England on Saturday. A cold front on Sunday. And now, one system after another in the northern stream coming along. We've got action in the southern stream. It was 90 in Miami yesterday, and it was 11 in Portland, Maine this morning. Each record's for the date, and another big storm is on the way. And look at this. It's March 24th, and we have ice on the rocks. <laughs> this time of year, to have ice on the rocks at the Atlantic Ocean when the sun is 45 degrees above the horizon. That's wild stuff. I think they call it March. Madness.